Hello fellow collectors and welcome to Long's Toys. I have a Loot Crate unboxing to do for you today. Now if you watch my channel, you'll notice I don't really mess with Loot Crate too often. And I'll be honest, most Loot Crate unboxings I watch, I don't really want anything that's in these. Uh, but this is actually the second in a trio of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle themed Loot Crates that all have exclusive NECA figures. So the first one was Mirage Comic themed and that had an exclusive uh, Mirage Comic uh, Shredder variant. This one is modeled after the Turtles in Time video game, so it has a figure uh, centric to that. And then the third one is going to be cartoon themed. And then if you bought all three, there was a fourth figure that they threw in. It goes with the, the third box, so they'll probably just ship those two together. But otherwise, it's just a Loot Crate black box here. I really like the sticker on the front. I think that's pretty cool. Uh, they just ship it right in this thing, so as you can see, it's a little beat up, but not too bad, luckily. I'm going to go ahead and flip this open. You just cut this uh, tape right here. And then we'll see if we can get this open. Here we go. So nothing too exciting. I thought maybe the box would have some kind of uh, design or, or something drawn inside. But as you can see, it's just kind of a boring, plain box. But it looks like we do have a t-shirt here. So let's see what we have. This is kind of cool. You can see it's the four turtles like at the top of the screen. It says turtle power in the middle. So that's kind of cool. And I like the color blue that it is. So there is the t-shirt element. This is the exclusive NECA figure, which is the main reason that I bought this. And apparently it is stuck there. But uh, this is a glow-in-the-dark shell shock turtle. So if you've ever played uh, the video game, when they get... Uh, electrocuted there's various ways they can do it in the game but they make this face and they kind of become skeletons like you can see through their body and it actually glows in the dark which is pretty cool I'll try it out a little bit later on once we go through the rest of the box but I'm very excited for that uh, looks like we also have some tape for some reason but these are I'm guessing stickers yeah I'm guessing they're just like puffy stickers but they're they look like the uh, word balloons from the game which is actually pretty neat. And then it looks like we have a piece of pizza. I'm thinking this is a pin. Yeah, there you go. That's kind of neat, like an 8-bit piece of pizza pin. <laughs> uh, we have another pin here. Oh, that's great. You got Krang after you defeat him towards the end of the game. That's pretty cool. And then it looks like there's a gold coin. That's pretty cool. Let me zoom in here so we can see this. Pizza Power Radical. And then that's that same picture of the turtle hanging out over the... It's the little, like, field at the top that has, like, how many uh, lives you have left and your score and everything like that. And the little turtle just hangs out there and says, One Up Dudes, Cowabunga. So that's kind of cool. It's kind of neat little coin there. Uh, let's see what else is in the box here. Looks like a keychain. Says Sewer Surfing. And then I'm not quite sure what's in this box but it's got tape all over it. Let's see. We have... This is... Oh, it's a little TV! That is really cool. Let me see, is there a... How do I open this? It's probably taped up here. Yes. Cut this open. There we go. So I'm assuming this is like uh, a little prop piece. So you can see it's got a uh, shredder on the screen or it's got April doing the newscast. It seems to really want to be shredder, but maybe if we can, that's when he takes over. That's really cool. That makes a great little display piece for your, your uh, NECA turtle action figures. I really like that. That's really cool. So I'm really excited about that. Um, this is just a box. I'm pretty sure that's everything in the box. I don't think I'm missing anything. Let's take out this little... There we go. This tells you everything. So there's a better look at the shirt. You have the action figure. You have the keychain. The gold coin. The stickers. And then the two pins. So I gotta be honest. I'm pretty excited about most of the things in this box. A lot of times there's always some like weird tchotchkes and stuff that I just really don't care about. But I mean, I have a slightly growing pin collection, so I'm cool with those. Keychain's not bad. Shirt's cool. I like the coin. I definitely have a 
bit of a coin collection uh, when you consider all the ones that Morphicon has given me over the years and things like that. Uh, so that's actually pretty cool. The stickers I could take or leave, but they're okay. Uh, and then I don't know why the, the TV is not even on here. I wonder if that's technically part of the figure. I don't know. They don't even really tell you about the TV. That's interesting. But I'm actually really excited for this box. Uh, all the stuff in here I actually like a lot. I don't think it's like... Usually there's always kind of like some stuff in here that you're like, what do I do with this now? <laughs> you don't really want it, but you don't want to throw it away. I actually really like everything in this box. I'm very excited. So very cool. So that's going to do it uh, for this Loot Crate unboxing. But let me go ahead and get the box out of the way here. And we will try out the glow-in-the-dark aspect of the figure. See, I will try to hold him up to the light and see if that makes any kind of difference. Uh, a little bit. If I charge it more, it would look better. I'm going to do a separate video to review this, and I'll do my best. I really just need to get, like, a black light, because if you put a black light on glow-in-the-dark stuff, it shows up immediately. And I just, that face is absolutely hysterical. It's exactly the face that it makes in the game, and they've just completely nailed that. I think they've done such a good job. So I'm really excited for this figure. I think the little TV is awesome as a prop piece. Uh, like I said, the stickers are all okay. I could take them or leave them. Um, the keychain, same kind of thing. It's a, it's a huge keychain. It's very big. But I think the gold coin's pretty cool, and I think the two pins are pretty cool. So that's going to do it for this uh, Turtles in Time themed loot crate. I think it's a winner. I don't know if you can still get them. I think it was a pre-order deal, but if they have some on the website, I definitely recommend grabbing one. Otherwise, I'm sure people will probably be selling this stuff individually on the secondary market. So, uh, but yeah, really happy, really excited, and loving this Loot Crate box. So let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Please like, share, and subscribe. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and as always, thanks so much for watching.